There's no doubt about it. Transmission technology has come a long way over the past decade or so. A very long way. Take Eaton, for example, with its classic road range of gearbox. Not all that long ago, it was a manual shift only, and several generations of truck drivers, millions in fact, learned to drive with a hand glued to the stick of a road ranger. I was one of them. But it's a different story these days. Sure, the bulk of Eaton boxes fitted to heavy duty trucks are still manuals. Today, though, there's a choice because there's also the automated Ultra Shift Plus version. So, what is Ultra Shift Plus? Well, to state it plain and simple, it is Eaton's newest automated shifting system, and it must be said, a much improved development over its Auto Shift predecessor. On the inside, it's a typical Eaton constant mesh mechanical transmission with all the same gear sets and shafts. But in Ultra Shift form, electronic signals determine when a shift up or down is made, and actuators do the physical shifting between gears as well as clutch operation. What that means is there's no gear stick and no clutch pedal, leaving the driver completely free to concentrate on road and traffic conditions and just steering the truck without any of the distractions or stress of being in the right gear at the right time. Just engage the drive button, release the brakes and push the go pedal. Or if needs be, the driver can select manual mode and take charge of when to make a shift or more importantly, when to hold the transmission in a lower gear on a long downhill run. It sounds simple, and it is. But is Ultra Shift Plus right for every job and every driver? Well, that's obviously a question for individual operators. The automated shifter does come with more cost and more complexity than its manual counterpart. But for round town short haul work, or even longer runs into regional areas, there's no doubt about Ultra Shift's attributes. Just as there's no doubt that as years go on, drivers who grew up with manual, multi-speed, constant mesh gearboxes are becoming increasingly harder to find.